This shot is called the crane. Oh, good lord. Oh, oh. There's the tenor. <laughs> Man down. <clears throat> Party foul. Scrambled eggs. South of the border. Below the belt. Yep, below the belt. I feel like I want to throw up. You playing a little basketball? Oh, wow. Uh -oh. <laughs> yeah, that's what he's doing. Look at this here, boy. Mr. Fancy Shoes himself. Are these things awesome or what? Still wearing them, huh? Three and a half days, I'm going strong, Jack. Every once in a while, Jeb gets all fired up about some weird product that he's bought off the internet. I'm fixing to jump out this building, windmilling Duncan, slamming, jamming on that sun gun. But here's the thing about that. You're short. I'm five, nine and a half. And you can't jump. I'm five, nine and a quarter. Deal with it. If you can dunk with them shoes, I'm gonna go buy me a pair. Hey, if he can dunk it, I'll buy me a pair. Put it above the rim and I'll snatch it. Three, two, you ready? one. No, I wasn't okay. ready. Hey, he wasn't ready. You ready? Here we go. Three, two, one. Go for it. I, you go. Oh, what? I, uh, rejected. Don't quit your day job, short stuff. Okay, these shoes are for training, not for actual dunking in. Well, go get the ball. I'll get that sorry excuse for a lob. It's pitiful. You want me to tell you what the key to dunking is, boys? What, did you learn that in Nam? Well, among other things, yeah. Benjamin Bunny. Give me that. Huh? I'm just to show y'all something right here. All right. I've been wearing these shoes a few days now, and I can feel a deep burn in my calves. Y'all ready? The guys are laughing now, but they won't be laughing when I tomahawk dunk in their face. Is this is right, what happens what when you, you use got. a duck shoes right here. Goose! What do you got? A man called Michael Jordan. Whoa! Tongue out, and I just sprained my ankle. He just sprained his ankle. Balling, y'all. Balling. You think we wouldn't notice that you lowered the rim about, what, two feet? Two foot. Y'all saw that, huh? How can you not see it? I mean, yeah. You're only five foot tall. Slime, five, nine and hey, a quarter. No. If you want to dunk, hey, do what the pros do. I don't have time to practice no, like no, that. No, no, hey, look, get on steroids. <laughs> <laughs> hey, cause look, come into the real world, okay? You're five foot tall and you'll never dunk it unless you get the old shot in the bucklets. Si, I say no to drugs. Well, I say no to dunking then, buddy. <laughs> air ball, air ball, air ball, air ball. Air ball. Ooh. Brick. <laughs> Galvin, it's not a brick. It's an air ball. Ball, please. Can you hit the rim? I'm nervous. Dang governor's coming in town. Let me shoot again. Why are you nervous? It's a governor. You are trying to tell me that's the reason you missed it? Yeah. My game's usually tight, but it ain't now. I'm too nervous. Huh? What is tight? Tight. Tight isn't good. Like, my shoes are tight. They're cool. They're tight. There's some real advantages to being the youngest brother. I'm more in tune with the younger generation. Who come up with that? I've always said that. You've always said that? I know who Dr. Dre is. I know who Criss Cross is. That's tight. Huh? So I know the lingo. Tight. This shirt is too tight. That's what the problem is. That's what's in style now. My jeans are tight. My shirt's tight. <clears throat> that, that burp was tight. And it had something behind it. <clears throat> your hat is tight. Huh? I like your hat. It's tight. Don't ever say that again to me. Are you going to shoot Pinocchio? What? <laughs> Pinocchio? What got to do with that? Helen Phillips? <sighs> hey! Air bomb. No. No. That was a brick. Well, I said brick while ago, and you said air bomb. It hit the rim. Really? So the governor's coming in a few hours. What's the problem? You're not supposed to be playing basketball. I told y'all to clean this up. We weren't technically playing basketball. This is the one day I actually need my employees to act like employees. The governor is coming here. This needs to look clean and nice. I'm not asking for the world. It's a warehouse. It's supposed to look like this. No, it looks like crap. At the very least, these guys can pick up boxes off the floor. We need to look our best. I've already told you this. Continue. Oh! 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 
these guys doing? Guys, the governor will be here any moment. And you got to get ready for Governor Jindal. Hey. Well, how are you, man? It's great hey, to see you. Hey, how you doing? Welcome. Welcome. Welcome to Duck Commander. Um, the, well, we're in the back of the warehouse here, but I missed you at the front. I, yeah, no, we just came back here. We got here early. The guys invited me to, to shoot around a little bit. Yeah, shooting basketball all day. I'm not usually the type of guy to say, hey, I told you so. They told me that they do their best work here, so I thought I'd kind of join in. Plan Is that on. what they said, huh? Okay, let's face it, I am that guy. Yeah, I, I'd let them get back here, and mostly for exercise purposes. After years of Willie complaining about us playing basketball in the warehouse, it's pretty nice to see him eat his own words. John Lee, you shooting it up, huh? Yes, sir. I've been looking for you. Probably why I missed the governor coming through. I'm just going to take a second and relish in the moment. This is good. So, Governor, do you need anything? I mean, well, yeah, I'd like these guys to play a real game. <laughs> That's probably a bad idea. We don't want to play a real game. I'll tell game. you what. You make a shot, we'll play a real game. But if you miss, I get a ride in Air Force One. That's a deal. All right. <laughs> Give me the ball. John Luke, I need to see you. Yes, sir. All right, here we go. I get the Air Force One. Are you ready for this speech? Oh! <laughs> I passed the hole. I think it'll work. Did you? Yeah. No. That's like size head. Empty. Look, if you lose a basketball, the game must go on. That's just the redneck way. Ah, uh, let's just keep playing with the Frisbee. You know, when I was a kid, we played Frisbee with a pizza pan. It's all in the wrist, boys. And look, when we lost that, we played golf with a hoe and a shovel. Oh, this is fun. The game is marching forward. This is our new game, Basket Bee. Pass. Make the pass. Oh! oh. I'm going to get my Jordan. Oh! Boom. Oh! Okay. <laughs> oh! oh. Hey, look. Here's a baby one right here. That's a water bottle cap. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, guys? Well, if it isn't old Manny. What's y'all doing? Play a little game of basket B. What happened to the basketball? The basketball is flat. That's weird. What are you writing down there, Manny? Don't worry about it. Anyway, we need to uh, rendezvous over there in the conference room for a little while. We got a meeting set up. Meeting? This is an important meeting. We need to have it, so. No. Nah. What are you doing that's so important that you can't meet? We got to do something. Inventory. Inventory. Yeah. Doesn't really look like inventory is happening to me. No, it was pretty good. You should have seen it. Speak What's of the up? devil. Oh, Manny. Manny. What's up, y'all? Looks like you've been rummaging around your bandanas. <laughs> <laughs> I was just trying to look more professional. What do you think? Kind of got weird earlier. So I went to the store. What you got here? Hey. Hey. Now we're talking. Trying to do my best to make the workplace better. I might have been a little quick to judge old Manny here. I mean, the basketball. That's a nice touch. Johnny did. I didn't tell you to go get a basketball. And the fact that it annoyed Willie? It's like giving Godwin a bag of Snickers and telling him not to eat it. Yeah, it's just dumb. Made it even sweeter. Theirs was flat, so I figured, you know, every once in a while you need to go shoot some hoops in the All warehouse. Right, we'll meet about this later. You did good, son. Welcome to the team. But you're still a rookie. All right, let's go. Back to work. Everybody good? Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. You know how hard it'd be to work? Staring at a brand new basketball? Jace, we're not playing basketball. Oh! Walk it in. Two uh, nothing. Two nothing. Two uh, nothing. Right. I'm open. I'm open. Pass me the ball. I'm open. Oh! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you ready? That's it. Oh. Blake Griffin, boys. Oh. It's fun working here. Ooh! Alley. Oh, my oh. God. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Hey, guys. What are you doing? We're getting in touch with our creativity. Hey, she's been learning all kind of good stuff from us. That's what I'm afraid of. Leaving Sadie with the guys provided the perfect learning opportunity. Where's your notepad? It's in the duck car. Shh. Because in business, it's important to know what not to do as much as it is to know what to do. Did I say that right? Chase, you're not supposed to be playing basketball. Sadie can shoot. 
And she made how many duck calls? Like 10. You made some duck calls? Mm -hmm. There's actions you take that put you on the upward path to being a CEO. She's way better than Jeff. Dun, 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 fire Jeff. What? And then the actions you take that keep you on the steady path of... Pow! Punch! Kick! Yeah, he's being Batman today. Right. I don't even know what you call that path, but it doesn't really go anywhere. Physical activity gets your creative process going. Physical activity is good for people. It's great when you're through working, not while you're working. This is where all our cool inventions come from. It's the last time you invented something. If you get a kit, oh, have boy. you a voice analysis duck call kit? For a business to thrive, you've got to be open-minded to new ideas. I've heard that one 20 times. It's still as stupid as the first time I heard it. That's not stupid. Yeah, that's stupid. Well, he doesn't seem to get that. And Sadie needs to learn it. Duck call FBI kit. It's a terrible idea. All great inventions come from an idea that someone thinks is terrible. You know how stupid that sounds? That's why they didn't think of it. <coughs> hey, you want to watch a movie? I got some movies in my bag here. What kind of movies? Well, I got Air Bud. Air what? Air Bud. Look, it's about a dog, OK, that plays basketball. Air Bud is a dog? Yeah. And these are classics. Look, I'm a connoisseur when it comes to animal sports movies. You got Air Bud when he's playing basketball. Air Bud is an epic classic that spawned a bunch of classics. Air Bud, golden retriever, he plays football. Huh? Great movie. It blows really right out of the water. We can go with Air Bud 4, all right? Seventh inning fetch. And hey, that's a classic one there. Hey, look, it made Field of Dreams look like the rookie of the year. We got Air Bud 5, Air Bud Spikes Back. I want to see that. They're all great. I watch old Born. Come on, that ain't realistic. Not At realistic. At least Air Bud is realistic. If it's Born, it's realistic. No. Yeah. No. No. Yeah. That is correct. Could the dog do what Born does? Hey, yeah, if he wanted to. <laughs> but he's in the sports. So you'll take a dog playing basketball over Born? Yeah. Are you crazy? No. Air Bud. I hope I never get bird flu. Right. You don't want this crap. Because evidently, it affects the brain. Air Bud.